shop local takes on a new meaning in the treasure state. In this week's Montana Made, MTN's Mackenzie Frost introduces us to the program branded to help Montana producers and growers launch their products. The Made in Montana icon, a symbol only certain businesses in the state bear, like notice snowboards and whitefish. Shape the core and then you drill out the binding inserts and then you put the sidewalls on the board. And Trailhead Spirits in Billings. <laughs> or even cleaning supply manufacturing company Diamond Products in Helena. These are just a few on the list. The idea, born in 1983 from former Governor Ted Schwinden. To identify Montana products to people not just in Montana, not just in the United States, but actually globally. Program manager Lonnie Stymack says being a member of the Made in Montana program is free, but the rewards are priceless. Once they join our program, we feed them into the pipeline of programs that the Department of Commerce has. Like financial programs and even social media. We have a much farther reach than we ever had before with just advertising. And the program has over 3,400 participants, creating hand-dipped candies like the parrot in the capital city. If at the same time you're using pure, unadulterated chocolate. Or growing Cracklin Kamut in Big Sandy. They have a real pride in what they're doing, and that shows up in their work. Stamek says Montanans aren't the only ones who take pride in their products. So do the 30 million visitors every year. And we know from the research and from the spending surveys that we do that they spent $70 million just on things that were tagged with Made in Montana. The Department of Commerce is preparing for the annual Made in Montana trade show, and Stymac says this year's event is bigger than ever. We are using every bit of space we can possibly use. Squeeze as many people in, yeah. yeah. With more vendors and visitors are expected, all hoping to create new relationships with community members as well as other Made in Montana producers. We're going to also tell you at the trade show where you can buy them around the state. And maybe even a new one. And all of a sudden, we've got the people who are making a Bloody Mary mix talking to somebody who roasts nuts. And they say, you know what, let's see what happens when we mix the two together. As these producers and businesses continue to do well, they aren't the only things that are expanding. You can create another job and it's for your son or your daughter or your neighbor's son or daughter. That's helping our small communities to grow. In Helena, Mackenzie Frost, MTN News. And the trade show Mackenzie mentioned will be held March 23rd and 24th in Helena. Over 170 booths will be on display at the Lewis and Clark County Fairgrounds.